Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Adijat Adeyemi. I'm a YouTuber based in Lagos State, Nigeria. So today I'll be making a video, much anticipated video ever, on how I edit my videos, my Instagram videos, or my YouTube videos. So if you don't have the app, go and download it now. Go to your Google Store or Play Store or App Store. Download InShot and download Pretty Up okay first of all i use my inshot first i already pressed it so i clicked it on my mobile phone i'm using an iphone guys so i pressed new you can see there are a lot of videos i have done i have i have, I have drafts of jobs i've done if you delete um, some clips of the video you cannot replay it back even after editing it okay guys so i chose some clips from my mom's um beautiful shoot, shoots i did earlier i really want this um video to be so detailed so you need to calm down and be patient enough to get to the end of this video so after selecting it i'm going to canva to change the format i want the full one because this is a an instagram video so yeah this is where the old editing starts so first of all I go to volume and remove all the sounds it depends if you want your sounds to remain you don't have to remove the volume then I start editing it I replay it and play back so now I clicked on splits I want to remove some clips out of it I just split it and delete it okay splits delete I didn't know the kind of um outlook i want my video to be i want it to have a smooth transitioning and stuff like that so this thing is very very easy and practical you just split the clips you don't want and delete it split is like you're dividing it and you're deleting it so the next i'm putting music so i already recorded um a video which has the music i want to on my phone so i'll just go there as you can see and press it and i'll select the place i want my music to start or to stop either way according to how you like it so yeah you can see that from before you can see the after so that's how i'm going to be doing it i split it and i deleted i don't want some part of the clips to show you can see that's like what i'm doing i'm splitting and i'm deleting i played the video and maybe there's this particular clip i don't like or i want a very smooth transitioning you have to calm down to like clean this thing guys okay so after splitting and deleting that part i decided i needed more videos so i just clicked a plus sign and chose like three videos i want so you can see I went to the speed i felt that it was too fast so i i if you go to the left hand side it's slow and if you go to the right hand side it's faster so you can choose the intensity on on how you want it to be see one of the reasons why i um put the music whenever i once start editing is that i want the editing to go in line with the music like the sounds the beats transitioning i want it to fit the music okay i want both to complement each other so to do transitioning i just press like the connection of the clips you can see there are a lot of transition as as shown on your screen this all these transitions that is here they are not paid for but you see those ones are in green lemon green 
or probably Amin Green. You have to like pay for it. So you can see even without subscribing or paying, you can use their apps. Can you see it, guys? You can see it. Then I chose that to um um check sign because I wanted it to be included in all the videos. So any any transition we have to use only one particular transition if you press that to check as there or you can also change it so you can see now i'm showing you the different formats that are in the canvas i'm not really using it i just want it this to be de um, to be detailed you can see the background different kinds of background that you can use you can use a colored background can you see guys so yeah back to the video so this is the sticker parts you can see there are a lot of stickers if you are a youtuber content creator you want to start there are different um youtube sticker there you can see subscribe you can see the one for facebook like share whatever he wants then the text part so you can see the t part you can write whatever thing you want then this is this part you know there are some videos that maybe you want to blow some part of the video and mm -hmm. that was what that's what that one for is for this one is do do maybe you want to like circle it or write something on it free and you can do it like that so the next thing i'm going to the filter you can see some effects there this is the ai effects can you see it there are a lot of things you can do on this app guys that a whole, whole lot of things so sincerely speaking after watching these videos you need to practice that's if you want to edit in a more professional way you need to practice hard there are a lot of features i can't even explore in all in this video can you see it? but these particular features you need to pay for it guys you need to pay to use this i'm just showing you a lot of things that you can do I'm actually screenshotting it, don't mind me, because I want to use it for something. So, you can see the effects, you can see the filter. So, this one is PIP. This one, eh, you can literally add um, two diff videos side by side, or maybe you can add it to one part. It's a video inside a video, as you can see. Okay. I'm not using it I'm just showing you all the features this one it is pre cut you can split it from there instead of doing that one I told you earlier so this one is animation there are different kinds of animation you can use in out combo is um, addition of the in and out together if you don't know okay So yeah, this is opacity, how you want it. If you want your video to be fainter or more thicker, there are features for all that here. You can see I'm just playing the videos for you to see. Then I'm going to save it. You can save it as 4K, 108 frame per second. Um, P, you can save it in any format you want to, okay? And now I've saved it. It doesn't really take time, but if you do longer videos, it will take time. So yeah, I want to show you. This is the drafts, okay? Just save it as drafts, so you can go back there and edit it again if you want to. So next, I'm going to put it up. I've selected that video. I just um saved from InShot. First thing I do here is to go to the blow. Can you see? I'm going to choose the intensity of how I want to blow it. You can see there are different kinds of um, shapes to blow into. 
but I chose auto. That one is like the usual blurry effects and you can choose the number or the intensity of how you want it to be blurred. Me, I usually choose like from 20 to 25, okay? So you can see it. My Instagram page is djaz underscore hello. If you want to like see how this video is, next I chose the face features. These are the features that they if you want to like reduce or increase a certain part of the objects um, or subject's body. So next I chose the beauty feature. I'm going to smoothen. You can smooth the um subject face you can see too much smoothness too is not good i usually use from 10 to 50. you get in the eye bag also you can remove eye bag um these are features that you can use free okay the nose um like bar to so just make it to be smoother that's just the effects of it then um, I like and stuff brightening is to bright the face. Then skin. This is my secret. This is what I use for to get my cinematic effect on videos. You see how the color changed? Can you see that, guys? This is just so crazy and nice. Then I go to toning. I can actually tone it a bit. I don't really use much um, intensity on this. Can you see that, guys? Can you see how beautiful my video looks like? Oh. So yeah, next one. There are different effects you can use. Can you see? Can you see? Do all these effects doesn't really match what I'm doing now, but I just want to make this video detailed. Okay. These are some features that you can use. This is the effect I showed you earlier. So this one also, you can use it to change the person's, um, to reduce or increase the person's um, body size, okay? And this is edit, you want to edit the video. So this one also, there are a lot of features in this app. So I'm done. Yeah, I'm basically done. I want to save it. I can reduce it to 720p or I can even increase it. Then I'll just save it. So after saving, I'm going to play it. This is before the video in e shots and this is after I brought it to pretty up do you see difference from the two yep i see a lot of difference you can see she has wrinkles on my face but i made her look younger and she's beautiful thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel if you've not and drop a comment if you have any more questions or any videos you want me to try out just drop down your comments okay thank you guys for watching bye